Ambassador Zelensky didn't announce that he was going to do any investigation of the Bidens or Burismas before the aid was released. He didn't was do a tweet, didn't do anything President. on CNN, didn't do any of that. President Zelensky, excuse me. Right, right. Um, and then what you have in front of you is an addendum that Mr. Sondland made to his testimony that we got a couple weeks ago. It says, Declaration of Ambassador Gordon Sondland. I, Gordon Sondland, do hereby swear and affirm as follows. I want you to look at point number two, bullet point number two, second sentence. Ambassador Taylor recalls that Mr. Morrison told, Ambassador Taylor, that I told Mr. Morrison that I conveyed this message to Mr. Yarmack on September 1st, 2019, in connection with Vice President Pence's visit to Warsaw and a meeting with President Zelensky. Now, this is his clarification. Let me read it one more time. Ambassador Taylor recalls that Mr. Morrison told Ambassador Taylor that I told Mr. Morrison that I conveyed this message to Mr. Yarmouk on September 1st, 2019, in connection with Vice President Pence's visit to Warsaw and a meeting with President Zelensky. We got six people having four conversations in one sentence, and you just told me this is where you got your clear understanding. Which, I, I mean, even though you had three opportunities with President Zelensky for him to tell you, you know what? We're going to do these investigations to get the aid. Didn't tell you three different times. Never makes an announcement. Never tweets about it. Never does a CNN interview. Ambassador, you weren't on the call, were you? The president, you didn't listen on President Trump's call and President Lindsey's call? I did not. You never talked with Chief of Staff Mulvaney? I never did. You never met the president? That's correct. You had three meetings again with Zelensky and it didn't come up. And two of those they had never heard about as far as I know. And president there was Linsky, no reason for and it President Zelensky never made an announcement. This, this is what I can't believe. And you're their star witness. You're their first witness. Mr. You're the Jordan. guy. You're the guy based on this, based on, I mean, I've seen, I've seen church prayer chains that are easier to understand than this. Ambassador Taylor recalls that Mr. Morrison told, now again, this is, I hereby swear and affirm from Gordon Sondland. Ambassador Taylor recalls that Mr. Morrison told Ambassador Taylor that I told Mr. Morrison and I conveyed this message to Mr. Yarmouk on September 1st, 20. This all happens, by the way. This all happens, by the way, in Warsaw, where Vice expired. President Pence meets with President Zelensky. And guess Ambassador what? Taylor, they didn't I, talk about any linkage either. Time of the gentleman's expired. Ambassador Taylor, would you like to respond? The only response, uh, I have two responses, uh, Mr. Chairman, thank you, and Mr. Mr. Jordan, glad to take those questions. Let me just say um, that I don't consider myself a star witness for anything. They do. You don't. No, uh, do. I don't. I, I'm just, I'm they responding do. to, uh, I'm responding Mr. to your Jordan, questions. Please don't interrupt Jordan. the witness. Um, as I, I, I think I was clear about, I'm not here to take one side or the other or to advocate any particular outcome. So let me just re restate that. Second thing is that uh, my understanding is only coming from people that I talk to. We got and that. I, uh, we got that. Um, and um, I think this clarification uh, from, Mr., uh, from Ambassador Sondland um, was because he said he didn't remember this in, the, in, in his first deposition. So he, he wanted to kind of clarify. But I think, Mr. Jordan, it, I, the way I read this, he remembers it the same way I do. Yeah, and it's real clear, right? It's thank, very clear to thank me. Thank you. Thank you, Ambassador Taylor. 